Well, why would hundreds of investors pour millions into a phony company set up by a con artist? As Jen Wa found out, there are some important lessons to learn from this particular case. He is probably one of the best salesmen I've ever seen in my life. Um, he was just believable. He is Jeff Curran, the founder and president of Gargoyles, Inc., an advanced materials application company. The uniqueness was all cloths are woven two-dimensionally, and he developed a method of weaving them three-dimensionally so that when he finished making his product, it was impenetrable to bullets. He, he was telling people that he had um, contracts with the military of foreign countries. Curran knew what he was doing. In one year, he sold more than $1.9 million worth of stock in his company, promising 10 times the return. It was an easy sell. It could even be used on the outside of Humvees instead of steel. In that way, the people in the audience and I looked at it, gee, this is a great investment. We'd be helping our soldiers. But it was all a lie. As victims started asking questions, they realized there were problems. And when I went in, it was him and a secretary and a big empty building with no one working. And I thought, if he has all these multi-million dollar orders across the world, somebody should be making the product. There were more than 200 victims. Postal inspectors say do your research before investing in anything. If the investment is a sound uh, investment, uh, the opportunity will still be there uh, for you to invest after you've had the chance to uh, do your research, do your due diligence, and, and find out uh, about the company. Jeff Curran was sentenced to three years in prison on securities and mail fraud. He was also ordered to pay $1.9 million in restitution. Jennifer Watt, Channel 4, The Local Station.